Who's in the truck with us? Me. Who else? With Myself. Us. With you. us. Some plant. What's his name? I don't know. I don't name my plants. This is Eli. Oh my God. Meet Eli. He's my friend. And Monkey said, well, I'm your friend too. And I said, yeah, but this one doesn't talk. <laughs> but he's cute. There was another one that was all bloomed up and everything, about nine, ten inches tall. I said, I want him because he's a baby, and I will take care of him and love him and feed him. Okay. This is Eli. I have a plan for you, buddy. Wait till we get home, and I'll give you some water. Okay. Oh, we are at Dairy Queen. Yes. Laughing our butts off. Yeah. And I, I, I am ready to get back home because I'm scared to death. I don't like being out. Camels are coming. Shut up. Hey guys, Shaber1000 here. There's Monkey behind me. Wave. <laughs> Check this out. This is what we're doing today. We're planting our little tiny vegetable garden. We got some more plants to go in here. So we're gonna have got some tomatoes here. That's the red beef steak. That's the super sweet cherry tomato, and that is another one. Oh, in here we've got the big birth of bell pepper. That one is the green bell. Which is what the Bonnie Bonnie Green Bell. So we're gonna put another red beef steak. Oh shit. We're gonna damn it. We're gonna put I don't know why these get jammed down in so far. A big beef tomato. We're going to put a grape tomato, which is kind of like a cherry tomato. And we got the hot cayenne. Hell yeah, that's what I'm talking about, right? So we're going to go ahead and put these in. We did these earlier and decided to go get a couple more plants. Okay, so that's our planting box there. It's got fertilizer mixed in with this. That's Miracle Grow potting soil. And we got the black cow, cow manure mixed in with this. So we're going to see how they grow. And as they grow, I'm going to put some uh, pieces of wood up here, however high I need to go, down through here. And then I'll run a piece of string across to hold these up and as they grow I'll put another piece of string wing time to that so anyway but that's not what we're doing um, I'm gonna get these plants in here and I'll show you what they look like and then I'll show you what we're doing next okay guys there they are all planted so looks pretty good hopefully everything will grow pretty nice we'll see all right on to the main project now Okay guys, sorry for the wind noise, but this is my plant I got today. This is what it is. It's uh, let me get my glasses on. This was 90% off too. A vinca. Now we had seen one blooming. Um, it was really tall and blooming. It was nice, pretty white flowers on it. But I liked him because he was just a baby. I don't know how well he's going to do because what we're going to do is we're going to make him a hole, a home out of this. We're going to cut this off. We're going to put him, plant him in here. Okay. So the first thing we're going to do is we're going to get this label off of here. Whoa. All right. There. Label's off. That's all we're doing to this thing. For right now that is well let's go ahead and right around here there's like a lip here so 
I want to try, if I don't cut my hand off or something, all right, I'm just going to cut right around this lip here. Don't have to be perfect because it's yours, right? So, now this is not my idea, guys. I've seen similar things like this done before. So, nice. I just sharpened these scissors today. So, and how I did that was I just took a piece of, what was it, 120 grit sandpaper. Made about five or six cuts in it. Sharpened them right up. You can do the same thing um, if they're not like super dull with um, aluminum foil. Cut some aluminum foil that you folded up. Okay, we're going to go ahead, we're going to put this cap back on here. I've got my old CD here, my old Tupac CD. That's right, I can't give it up. It's hard to give up a Tupac a day habit. <laughs> Just kidding, I don't, this is a DVD, I don't know what it is. Someone has evidently, apparently burned it. So... We're going to set this down here for now. What we're going to do is glue this on here like this. And we're going to put um, little Eli down in there. So let's see if the glue is hot yet. We've got monkey's glue gun here. Okay. So what we're going to do, we're just going to want to just glue it right on here. Okay, just take it, smack that son of a gun right on there like that, just like that. Now I'm going to go around here too, you can paint these when you're done, but I'm just going to leave it like this. So. Hope everyone is enjoying their weekend. Um, I did get out today, and I shouldn't have, but with Monkey being sad and stuff, I I uh, did go with her wear my mask. We went we went to go get some get the plants. Well, she had the other plants, but we needed a couple more, so we, I went with her. She said, "Do you want to go with me?" I said, "Yeah, I'll go with you." Um, Cause you know, just to get her out for a little bit. Um, but what I did like to see, 90% of the people that were in there with us had their masks on, so that was nice to see. I really didn't want to go, um, but like I said, she wanted me to go with her, so I obliged. Ugh, I'm sweating. It's like 90 degrees out here, folks, or something like that. Okay, now I'm just going to kind of break him up a little bit. I don't know how well he's going to do in this little in his little hole here, but we'll just have to see. Break that up a little bit and see if we got to add any more soil or not. No, I think that's going to be fine. It may stun his growth, but like I said, I've seen other ones the same flower, the Vinca or whatever um, that was blooming very nicely in their little pots. So, and we've got some plant food for our plants. You just mix it with water. And so, I may get him down here a little bit further because see, you can see the, you can see his roots there. So let's get him down in a little bit farther, and we'll get some more of this stuff. cover up his roots. That way his feet aren't naked. <laughs> but this is my little buddy Eli. Meet Eli everyone and we'll see how well he grows. Now I'm going to take him in and give him a little bit of water. Make sure he's got plenty of sunlight. You only have to... Shit, I bet that glue wasn't dry. Oh, thank God it was. Um, but uh, now you only have to have to water these guys twice a week. Now since he's not going to be in a great big pot and stuff, I may have to water him more. 
we'll just have to see but he does need a little bit of water right now which that's what we're going to do we're going to go give him some water okay all right guys so here's little eli we've got him nice and cleaned up i probably should have peeled that off but i figure see i can keep an eye on his roots and if they start getting too filled up in there, I may have to replant him. But for now, until he starts blooming, which he will bloom three times a year, he'll bloom in the spring, the summer, and the fall. So he will bloom three times. And I'll take him outside with me every day when I go outside so he can get his sun. And I will water him when he needs it. We just watered him. He's got plenty of water. And this is the, the plant food we got. It was like five bucks. Um... So it's you just you just mix it up with water, according to you open this up here, and there uh, are the instructions, and you either mix it in a watering can or a spray bottle, like a spray bottle for indoors, and you can mist them, and get the roots, and it's supposed to be good, good all-purpose water-soluble plant food. So you know we'll give him some of that, but not today. I'll give it to him tomorrow once he gets you know a little more acclimated to the to his little new new little home here so there we go so and there's the plant food we'll be using on the other plants if needed okay guys so there's our little project for today Whew, sorry i'm sweating it's, it was it's hotter than hell outside just kind of you know still trying to stay at home but you, sometimes you got to go get some things to be able to stay at home for a few days you know so monkey's off for like the next week um they, her company sent her a nice bouquet of flowers over there. Um, but anyway, I want to say thanks to all you guys who uh, who have my back. I, I wasn't expecting the turnout that I got with that. Wow. You know, um, amazing. Thank you guys. Thank you, thank you, thank you very much. Uh, I knew, you know, I know that's how you can tell a real person. Real people, you know, know when something bothers somebody because they've probably been there, been through it themselves, and they don't want to sit back and act like all high and mighty and shit like I never get pissed. So you guys are true. And though we've never met, I know I consider all you guys, you're my friends, my personal friends to me, you know. I mean, that's why we have, you know, our personal info to uh, correspond back and forth. But I do appreciate it, guys. Thank you so much. Monkey's outside. She doesn't know I made this yet. So I'm going to go show her, and um, hopefully you enjoy the rest of your weekend. Thanks again, guys. I appreciate it. Stay safe, and uh, stay cool. <laughs> stay better than the man of legend. I'm gone for now. Bye-bye, guys. Take care, and thanks again. Look. I made him a little home. Aww. Where are you going to put him? Uh, he's going to stay in there until he gets bigger. Yeah. i got to keep an eye on the roots. If they start building up too much, then I'll, I'll um, replant him. But for now, that's his little home. Okay. That's what I was making. Oh, that's cute. Every day I'll take him out with me to get his sunshine. Okay. And he only gets watered twice a week unless he dries out quicker for some reason. So, that's a little Eli. That's my friend. So, that's what I was making. Alright, guys. So, Monkey liked little Eli so much. She had a couple of plants left over that she didn't have anywhere to put yet. This one was all by self, that poor little guy. So, she kind of hinted, you know, I got two more left. So, and I happen to have two more extra DVDs, two more of these things. <laughs> <laughs> so I obliged her by making her two more. There you go, Monk. Thank you. Bye, guys. They work really good. Bye.